Hey everyone, just wanted to create a quick video for you guys here. So we were replacing the lower driver's side control arm on a 2006 Scion TC. This procedure will work for a 2005 to 2010. So the issue was that there is a bolt that attaches the lower control arm on the front closest to the engine and that bolt will not clear the transmission pan. We looked on the internet to try to find a solution and ended up coming up with a solution on our own that is pretty simple and I wanted to outline that for you here so hopefully I'll save you some time when you run into the same problem. Thanks. Enjoy. The brilliant engineers designed this thing where there is a bolt. This, no, it's not this bolt. So the bolt, if you're running into this issue, replacing the lower control arm here. There is a bolt, obviously, it needs to go through this part of the cross member and attaches the lower control arm right there. The brilliant engineers made this bolt where as you come out with it, it doesn't clear the transmission pan. So, not a great design. <laughs> so I looked online and tried to find a way to overcome that. There wasn't a lot of information out there, not even in the service manual. So what we ended up having to do is end up loosening this bolt right here, or excuse me, loosening that nut right there. We loosened, we removed the nut, this was right there. Actually, that was a bolt. Remove that bolt there. Then what you gotta do, support the transmission, come up in here, you gotta remove the battery and remove the air filter and then remove the main bolt out of the engine mount there. And then come around the front of the motor and remove the two bolts going into the motor from this engine mount here. And proceed to jack up the engine. Jack up the engine. Then it still won't clear. So what you got to do is the reason those two bolts were that nut there and that bolt there was removed. So you got to take a bar, something pretty heavy duty, put it right down there, and wedge it in there real good and pull down. That'll allow it to clear just enough the other eighth of an inch that it needs to go down. Pull that down real hard and it bolt, the bolt will come right out. So, super frustrating. Uh, we fought with it for a good, I don't know, a couple hours <laughs> before we figured that, that out. Um, so yeah, so if anybody else ever runs into that issue um, and you're left thinking you're gonna have to drain the transmission, you don't have to do that. Just uh, follow those steps and you should be able to get it out.